Yo, what's good everybody? I'm back and I got a short story for you. It's about how I got my first pair of Air Jordans. So my first pair of Jordans were the Metallic Silver 5s. I got them around April. Uh, I had a couple extra birthday dollars to spend and I was riding around the town with my moms and my boy Matt hit me up and he said, Villa down the street has a pair of Maroon 5, I mean, oh God, Metallic Silver 5s left. What are you gonna do? I said, Matt, I'm about to go get them right now. He said, no way. And I was like, I'm on my way. I had to get them. And here we are. I get to the villa. They're like, are you the guy that called the bottom? I'm like, no. And he's like, uh, some dude called and he said he's going to be on his way, but you're here first. So yeah. I'm in line. I'm paying. You know, they have your little, uh, someone takes a picture of me and puts it on the villa Instagram. So I'm like, that's cool. I got the box. I'm cheesing. I'm looking weird. And uh, as soon as I'm swiping my card to pay, it came to like 203. I remember the price because that was the most I've ever paid for a pair of Jordans because that was my first. But it came to 203. And as soon as I swipe, the dude walks in and, and I know who he is. He gave me the Marshawn lunch. You know why I'm here to look. And I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm paying for my shoes. You, you messed up. You should have been there. That's a good thing you weren't because now I have the pair of Metallic Silver 5s. And. I have the flash on for this because hopefully you'll be able to see all the 3Mness and shit that's in this tongue. So that was a quick little story on my first pair of Jordans. Uh, the fives that I really want, I think there's a, a shoe in every like Jordan category as far as the number up until 14 that I want. But I really want the Oreo 5. So agree with me. However you want, leave it in the comments, let me know. But those are hot. But the metallic silvers are, are classic. They're just so white and they're they're so nice that you really you don't want to wear these all the time. You can't just rock these. Like you can put them on, you know they're sweet, but you you, you can't rock these. All right, you this is a shoe that you want to keep fresh for as long as you can. And the tumbled leather on these are so nice. And I'm I'm pissed because I got a crease right here, but that's okay because they still look good with the crease and. This is just an excellent shoe overall, and I'm glad that it became my first shoe because this shoe really got me into, I guess you would call it the sneaker game. I got a, I have a few nice pairs, and uh, as soon as I bought that, I'm going to tell you one more thing. I just finished putting all these shoes on Snup, so they're all still right here, and follow me at rhail 63 but these, okay, mind you, it's my birthday. And I just got paid, so I had a couple of dollars to spend, and I, they really just came out, and uh, I think I paid two sixty eight for these Georgetowns, two sixty eight. That's the most I've ever paid for a pair of shoes, way more than I should have. But two sixty eight got these right after I bought those. So I was, after I bought those, that really it set the rolling ball. But um. Thanks for listening to my short little story. Much love to all the fam, and I'll see you in the next video.